Okay, um, we should be live now. Uh, hello everyone, my name is Brick Stoic. Welcome to the first live stream in a very, very long time. Uh, the last few live streams I did weren't very successful. I'm kind of hoping that this is okay, where it's following, like, the shorts format. Um, hopefully we should get a little bit more traction here. However, in this stream, we're not doing Minecraft. No, no, no. We're kind of past those days. We are doing Giganto from Sonic Frontiers in Lego form. Uh, I'm using Brickling Studio here to, um, to basically model it. I do plan to build this in real life. Uh, hey, welcome to the chat. Glad you're here. Um, I I'm not sure how to pronounce your username. <laughs> but yeah, so, uh, Giganto. I've got a video here that... We're going to be copying, uh, maybe not this one. I'm looking for one, yeah. We're going to be copying this video, trying to figure out uh, the best size comparisons, uh, angles, shapes, etc. We're going to work all of that out with Giganto. This is probably only going to be part one of the stream because uh, Giganto is massive. Uh, yeah. Also, side note, the music for this boss fight is really good. So, this is what we got so far. Uh, Blazing Bricks, welcome to the chat. Uh, hope you enjoy the stream. So basically, this is all what I designed a couple months ago, and then back here I designed yesterday. Uh, I'm thinking that this needs to be a bit bigger. Oops, forgot you can hit tab to do that. Um, let's see here, what, what can we design today? So it looks like these are going to need to be quite bigger. Recommend using a 3D model from Scratch and Fab to Scratch Fab to see the angles. That's probably a very good idea. I don't have Scratch, but I keep hearing so many great things about it, so I probably will end up getting Scratch for ideas like that. For now though, this is what I've got. Uh, gonna move this out of the way because we need to do some upgrades. Oh, that wasn't supposed to come off. So that's gonna go back right there. I'm also not designing instructions for this. I could, but right now I'm just trying to get a general idea so I can build it uh, in real life. Because this is, this is my plan for our uh, Sonic Frontiers video uh, with the Chowlug group. Frontiers is on the to-do list, but it's not coming around for a, a little while. However, Giganto is also, well, gigantic. So I need to get a bit of work done to figure out what I'm actually going to do with it. This is going to be my most expensive video yet. Because I don't have a lot of these parts. So I will need to order them. Um, let's move this over here. So this was the kind of the skeleton I had for for the chest, and it needs to be bigger, quite bigger. Thought that was a good size for it. I guess maybe we'll just expand it by a little bit. Uh. I guess we could also maybe turn this stream into kind of like a Q&A thing, just so you guys in the chat don't really get bored. Just watch me snap these digital parts together. But yeah, um, already seeing quite a bit more traction than my usual Minecraft streams, which is nice. Or usual, I don't do them anymore. But um, yeah, it's cool to see that there's a little bit of attention here. Now, the question is, does this part exist in dark bluish gray? Does, great. Gonna need a one by one. There we go. Also, uh, recently, uh, I don't know how many of you guys in the chat were here for it, but um, Brickspiration did a live stream a while ago, and uh, I found that his that stream that that stream is very relaxing for 
like little like to keep me focused on other projects so how many of you guys in the chat also have a similar thing where you just turn on something for background noise to help you concentrate i find it an interesting idea i want to know like how common of a practice it actually is okay so we got that now i'm also going to delete the other side so that we can just copy and paste it a little bit and then let's see here that that's a pretty good shot of the belly I think I could manage that um, interesting shaping though that's gonna be a bit hard to design hmm uh, I guess we'll just focus on the front for now, and then work on the sides later. But I guess that might mean I'm going to need a little bit more track to work with. Probably not that much. Um, yeah, actually that much. <laughs> uh, was not expecting that. So, let's uh, first of all clone that to the other side. <laughs> hanging on to the other side. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what we're doing here. Um, now that that's looking like a cool spaceship. I always love spaceships. Um, and then I guess this is like tiles. This would be... Or maybe I could... Maybe if I did this. See, so I gotta build every individual segment and then piece it together somehow. By the way, tell me down in the chat, uh, what is it, what is your favorite soundtrack from Sonic Frontiers? Mine would personally be uh, either I'm Here or Undefeatable. I don't really like a lot of the others. Okay. So we can get rid of that now. Um, so... If we angle this upwards, let's drag it up as well. Now we gotta work on those sides. Which those look like they're just a bunch of plates at about how wide? I don't really think in uh eight studs. Eight studs looks about right. Um let's go with that color. Cool. Is it all going to be tile? So it looks like it kind of slopes up and then wraps around for a curve under that. How am I going to build that? That is going to be pretty tough. So I guess we could just put it at an angle. No one would really notice, but... Wait, hold up. Hold up a minute. This is way too thin. Yeah. Actually, this is just a cool shape. But it, it's too thin. We need, to, we need it to be a bit thicker. Okay, let's get rid of the other side. We'll come back to it later. Uh... How many bricks are we thinking? What what le how many layers of plates? Mm. Not plates, bricks. I'm not bricks. <laughs> okay, uh By the way, is the audio coming out okay? I feel like it should be. But I just wanna make sure. So let's go with that thick, maybe? Let's 
Let's move that in there. I think that's reasonable. I can work with this. Okay, now we'll clone it around to the other side. <laughs> Every single time I say to the other side, it is, it's like quite literally a copy of the actual song, which isn't on purpose, but it's still funny. Audio is perfect? Okay, good to know, thanks. Now that is a decent body shape. Now we can move on to the plates. We were going with this part, I believe? No, we were going eight steps wide. So it's like that. It's gonna be gray, and we're going to angle it on its side. The problem here is another big problem with this is structure, because like I I plan to build this in real life, but if it's if the structure isn't strong enough and can't support it, then the whole thing will topple over. Wait, what is wait what part? What? That part doesn't exist? Mm. That can't be right, what? Oh! Oh, I see what the problem was, okay. That was an older piece. Yeah, there we go. That means it should be... You know, uh, Gabe Productions 2022 says hyperstock. Hello to you too, how you doing? Place it with that. There we go. Okay. Wait, Brock Stoic. <laughs> That's not how you spell my name. <laughs> Alright, it's fine though. So what is the cheapest color for this? Tan. Thought so. I'm going to bring this up. Okay. Um So I'm gonna move it over to the side just a bit. Uh, I'm doing good. Yeah. Uh, just having a pretty relaxing day designing a giant alien monster robot. The standard. <laughs> okay. So then. Then it kind of just cuts off here, and I gotta make a curve of some kind. Guess what I can do is fill this area in with bricks at an angle, like that. And that's mostly hidden. I'm gonna add the correct brick, which is that. And then one more brick there. Cool, so that's that area. I think we're we're getting a good shape. We're getting this now. Um Sup nerd? Uh <laughs> Uh well doing good. Never actually thought about how to respond to sup. <laughs> but uh how you doing? Enjoying this fine day? Okay, so now we just copy that. Do we ever see the back of... Oops. Do we ever see the back of Giganto? I'll have to watch the video again. I know that Sonic has to climb it at some point, so... It's probably a good shot of the back there. I'm thinking, I'm thinking a little too far ahead. Just gotta focus on the task at hand. Okay. Um... Go to about here. Right now, we're not actually building it necessarily. Okay, we are, but uh, I'm just trying to outline the general shape. And I could probably achieve these angles with some some of those stormtrooper shield parts. Like those are always great to use. Yeah. Okay. Perfection. Right there. That is going to work. 
but now I have to make it kind of fade into it. Like, you see that? Um, we gotta kind of make it curve and... My dog just yawned in the back. <laughs> uh, I can make that. That's... How am I gonna do that, though? Uh... Let's see here. Hmm. This is getting. I'm trying to figure this out here. Um, curves. Curve parts. What would you guys recommend? Like, how would I make a curve that kind of fades? Wait a, second, wait a minute. I think I have an idea. To give it a little bit of texture. <clears throat> Take two. Uh, <laughs> to give it a little bit of texture, I'm going to create this. The Giganto video, by the way, where I actually build this in real life, uh, that is, that's going to be kind of further down the line. I got a few other videos in the works currently. Oh yes, 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 yes. That will work very nicely. Um, so first I guess I need to create a plate that will I'll hold it together. Uh, that looks like it'll be about right. And if it's not, I can modify it just a little bit. You guys in the chat are really quiet. <laughs> okay, I think the lime, yeah, lime. Lime, I'm discovering, is a very cheap color, which is very good for LEGO builders because it means we don't have to spend as much or go broke while trying to make content, both of which are a plus. Um... Yeah, that's, there we go. Orange, okay. I'm basically going up and selecting the, um, the lightest, the, the cheapest color, just so that, uh, when inevitably I do have to buy this, it's going to cost less. In fact, I'm going to have to buy all the parts to this, and then also buy, uh, the Supersonic Lego set that's coming this summer. <laughs> you fall into an uh wow uh vent vemel vemeline says i fall into a new low i'm playing roblox wow that is that is kind of a new low yeah <laughs> i mean i've never actually played roblox myself but it it doesn't really look that entertaining Like, I feel like Roblox is one of those games that everybody's just like, oh, you play Roblox? What? Why? And then, really, everybody kind of just thinks it's so cringe, yet everybody has it. So, kind of like TikTok, actually. Most people all shame TikTok for being super cringe, and then nearly everybody's got it. Okay, building up stuff. A big challenge here is going to be shaping the core around this build. But oh yeah. Yeah, this will do nice. It's kind of reminding me of the Giga Chick construction. <laughs> Wait, can I? I forgot. Can I do poles here? I can't do poles from the phone. Okay. Hmm. So I guess the next step will be constructing the arms, and I'm not gonna let those move. I, I'm not. I don't want. I don't want the arms to move. But cool. So we've constructed this. Uh, oh yeah. Don't worry. By the way, right now Supersonic does not exist in actual Lego form. So uh, this is this is an illegal character at the moment. It's just. Bricklink's Sonic model, and actually a few of the custom parts. 
uh, imported into studio. I can't wait to see the supersonic we get. Okay, so now this might get a little bit laggy. Oh, no, it's fine. Okay, cool. So this needs to come up over and down. Oh, I'm missing out on a part there. Looks like it needs to go a little more further that way. And just a tad this way. I think that's it. So that's where it will be. For now, I'm going to move it off to the side so I can work on this. Um, well, I guess I better start a conversation that everyone can participate in, in the chat. Um, the chat is going very low. We need more members. We need more people to chat. <laughs> Copy this to here, that to there. So, for those of you who have played Sonic games, what is your favorite? Like, what is the greatest Sonic game, in your opinion? Um, I guess I better get a shot at the back. Oh, okay. What on earth? That, so, okay. Shoulder blades. Uh, well, that's fine. We can ignore that because we're not going to make the arms move. But then that? And then... Okay. Okay. Those are some crazy attacks, by the way. Oh boy. Oh um, no. Um... I wish I actually had Frontiers. Come on, I want a good shot of the back. That will not do for the back. And hold up, those joints. Those joints are gonna be tough. We also have these things. Um, so how will I incorporate the... Got it. Uh, if I go over to the front, I think I can replace some of these with snot bricks. We're gonna, we're gonna do this. Um, Place that part there, and then we're we need a bunch of headlight bricks like that. No, no, no! I want this to be black. There you go. Uh huh. I like that a lot. Uh, Alfred, uh, Alfred Vagato says, hi, it's me. Hello, welcome to the, welcome to the stream. Hope you're enjoying things. We are building Giganto. So, let's go with that. Did I use a 1x2 anywhere? I feel like I did, but I guess I didn't. So that goes there, and then I need that one by one here. Okay. Uh, you remember me? Um, I've done a lot of streams. It's hard to remember everyone. So uh, remind, uh, tell me, tell me something you said, and I might remember. Uh. 
Come on. Uh, tiles. Oh, wait, I was just in tile. <laughs> Need those grill parts. Come on, come on. Where are they? May modified? Tile modified. Yes, bingo! That's exactly what I want. And I guess I'm gonna wanna go with a chrome flat silver! That's exactly what I wanted! Thank you for knowing, studio. Um, okay, so it's not entirely accurate. In fact, the grills are actually supposed to go sideways. Oh, dear. Um, ask me anything. Yeah, I've done two of those streams now, and there was always 40 people at a time. Okay, uh, so this isn't going to work. I'll keep one of those so I can clone it later. But these are gonna go. Uh, Muggly GYT says hi. Hello to you too. How's it going? Okay, so I'm going to cover this area up now because that won't do. And in fact, we got to make it go this way. Ask me anything, one. Yeah, again, uh, I, 40 people had a time in that stream. By the way, is this actually live streaming to shorts? It's hard to say. Uh, what's this website? This is Bricklink Studio, or Stud.io, as it's sometimes referred to. Uh, it's an app that you can download for free, and it allows you to digitally design any Lego parts, or any Lego model. If I adjust, if I go adjust the stream just a little bit, if I if I move that over there, I should be able to temporarily show you. Like this, this right here is the app that I'm using. Okay, now I've got to reset my stream so it's centered again. I'm trying to live stream to the shorts feed, and I don't know if that's working today. Oh, thanks. No problem. Always happy to help out. Um, so now we're going to go with that. And I think that should do it. Hopefully I'll get the desired look. Uh, Muggly says, how are you today? I'm doing good. How about you? Uh, it's a very, very enjoyable day. I'm getting reports that there is an upcoming storm, but for now, it's, I'm happy with the weather. It's, it's nice and cool outside and still a little bit sunny. Okay, that's looking like it's a bit too small there. Oops, I meant to go to Chrome. So maybe... Hmm. Thinking, what can I do here that will make it look, stand out? Um... If I can... Wait, let's delete these. And replace it with an actual one by one and a one by two. Uh, 
Uh, I think normal live streams is a little better, but when I'm watching you, everything is great and I'm good today. Aw, thank you. Yeah, the next the next uh, big Q and A live stream, by the way, that's I'm going to do that once we hit one thousand five hundred subscribers. I feel like that's a good that's a good uh, milestone before hitting the ne doing the next live stream. Let's go another gray, actually. I think that's good. That, that looks nice, but maybe if I, if I could just replace that with this. Oh, I'm, I'm having a great idea. And move it over to the side there. Oops. No, no, no. Cooperate, please. No, nope, there we go. That'll work. Uh, King uh, King of Cats 2 says, Hello, I like saying dot. Yes, I know you like saying dot for my Discord. <laughs> you say dot a lot. That, that rhymed. There was that. I did not mean for that to rhyme. <laughs> Going to need a bunch of these slopes now. Cool. And this is a very similar construction to the Giga Chick. Is that gonna clash at all there? I think we just barely make that. Like that's not gonna clash at all. We also have something here. Cool. Um, now what? We got another thing down there. All these grills are for texture, obviously. Uh, King Cat says, yes I do, smiley face. Bye bye, gotta go eat lunch. All right, see you later, cat. Meanwhile, Mugly, uh, Mugly GYT says, uh, I make YouTube too, I make stop motion, but you have, uh, you have way more subscribers than me because you make better content. I mean, well, thanks for the compliments, but uh, it, it is all just a learning curve. Once you learn the YouTube algorithm, you can pretty much get a decent amount of subscribers. My last video, though, I don't know why that flopped so badly. Um, 500 views, which that's kind of average for normal videos, but for a Sonic video, that's, that's, that's an all-time low. What's with the coloring? Um, so the random colors, and there's even more random colors over here. These are all of the parts that I'm using, except at their cheapest price. Uh, so I, if I go over here, uh, it generally gives price 0.648 USD. No, I think about how much this actually is that. Uh, but then if you go up to color, then it will say. Cheapest color for the selected, and that's medium nougat. Which, it didn't give me that option before, so thank you for giving me that option now, studio. <laughs> but yeah, that's why they're all colored so weirdly. It's due to, um, it's due to, uh, price. I'm trying to get this in the cheapest possible price so I can actually order it. Oh no, the King Cat is spamming dot in my Discord again. <laughs> oh no. Sonic is great, I love him. Yeah, Sonic is awesome. He's got, he's possibly one of the coolest, he's got like one of the coolest franchises. Sonic Dream Team, by the way, is getting a content update in just a few days. Like new levels, uh, missions. Yeah. I think even character moves, although I'm not sure about that part. Okay, so then we got this thing down here. Wait, do we have any? Okay, no, it looks like we don't have any kind of, oh, we do, we do. There was a bit of a battle scar there. Uh, yeah, yeah, I plan to buy the Lego parts for this. Okay. 
Yeah, there is a little bit of a thing. It's hard to see, but looks like we got to make a small scrape in there. So, first of all, we replace that. And then I need to come around here for that snot brick. Where was it? It's that, right? Nope. That's fine. I'll just grab it from here. And boom. Cool. Did my walls just crack or something? What was that? Like, I think I just heard a crack in my wall. Uh, a supersonic doesn't exist, but he comes, uh, but he, but he doesn't exist yet. <laughs> Lego, yeah. Um, Supersonic doesn't exist yet, that's correct. However, there he's he is set to come out in the summer wave of Lego Sonic sets. Uh, Supersonic versus the Egg Drillster is the set that he's rumored to come in. There's no official images of the set yet. Um, however, we do know it's coming, because generally LEGO, all Lego leaks are correct at this point. Uh, so, Supersonic is coming, and uh, me and the Chowla group plan to make Frontiers uh, with Lego as soon as Su Supersonic comes out. However, that's a bit of a long way away, so I think, and I'll, this is going to be a big project, so I think I'll get started now. You know? Yeah, okay. Is it, like, yeah, here's, um... Here's Supersonic. Studio kind of makes him look more more gold. Um, but also, I couldn't get his red eyes because that kind of requires like a new custom printed piece, which is fine, but didn't really want to do that. So anyway, I wonder if Studio has yet gotten a Sonic update yet. Studio hasn't, so it's all just mecha print. Oh, and they have these these finally. Thank you. <laughs> What if I type in hedgehog? No, okay. So now I think this is gonna be a tough core to build. Because it's gotta, first of all, the core will need to connect all these elements together. And then it also has to connect the head without toppling over while standing on the teeny tiny legs. Uh, Mindstorm's, Mindstorm's production says, uh, Hi, I'm a big fan. Oh, thank you. Uh, meanwhile, I'm ugly. Do you, uh, do you think that we will become big? Do you think we will get a Big the Cat? Uh, I think Big the Cat will come. Uh, he was kind of big in Lego Dimension. No pun intended. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Big the Cat played a decent role in LEGO Dimensions, so I feel like we should get him soon. Getting Shadow so soon was a bit unexpected, so really anything's possible. I would say, though, that um, uh, characters such as Silver or Blaze, I, those feel kind of far out at the moment. Right now, we're limited to just the knockoff son, uh, Blaze and S Silver, which is bum which is a big bummer. Okay. So... Looks like we got a lot of hexagon shapes. Can I, can I capture that detail? Maybe? I think it's best that we just ignore that for now. Uh, do I think Amy Rose will appear in the third movie? Yes, I do. Uh, while no credible leaks have said that there will that she will be in the movie, just the amount of leaks kind of makes me think that she will be. And that's probably poor judgment, but um, I don't know. I feel like it's likely. Shadow being the only new character, it I don't think so. Uh. But then also, 
At the same time, though, I don't want them to keep adding characters because this is Sonic the Hedgehog, after all. Can you really include so many characters before you start focusing on them instead of Sonic, who is the main character? So they have to strike an interesting balance there. Uh... Don't think Hypersonic is ever coming? Probably not. I I really doubt Hypersonic will ever make an appearance in LEGO form, or back in the games. Uh, but it would be cool. Like, he'd be welcome. Hypersonic would be 100% welcome. Although, if he made his way into the movies, oh, that would be so cool. So... I'm gonna need, like, one of those Stormtrooper shields, because those are really good at creating good angles. That's, wait, maybe not, though. Maybe I don't want those, because they're kind of gonna fall off eventually. Another cool thing, by the way, you can do with this program is uh, we've got a stability tool, and if I click it, it gives me a bunch of errors and notifications uh, where there's a potential not stable warning. A lot of these I know are fine. They're not going to cause problems. Other than, like, the pink is just weak clutch power. Red is, like, clash warning, I think. And there is a lot in the head I designed, but I, I think it's fine. Like, I've used some of these techniques before. And they haven't really served me wrong before. So I think we're fine there. The neck is where I'm worried, though. There's a few places in the neck that aren't very strong. So let's disable that tool. Hypersonic in the movies. Man, that would be so cool. But you know what would also be cool? Just getting some of the Frontiers music. That would be so That would be super um, what type of hinges are you going to use for the legs and arms? That's a good question. Uh, I don't think I want to use ball joints because ball joints are generally very flimsy. They're designed to be pulled off with just a simple snap. And the weights would definitely not go well with it. Then there's the then there are a few other types of hinges that wouldn't be great, but I think what I'm just going to do is use Technic to hold it into place and not actually let it move at all. It's going to be a giant display piece, not a not a play thing, um, which is a little bit unfortunate. Let's see here. I'm going to go to one of my other imports, which has some. Uh, should have the hinges I'm looking for to hold these together. Unless it doesn't. I think this is it. No? Okay. Uh, do I think Sonic 3 is just Sonic Adventure 2, but as a movie? I think so. Uh, not a one-to-one -one recreation. We already know New York City is going to be a location. Uh, yeah, so I don't think it's going to be a one-for-one -one recreation, but it's going to be pretty close. Let's see here. Uh, everybody wants LEGO Sonic Frontiers, but I want LEGO Sonic Adventure. That's agreeable. Yes. Sonic Adventure in LEGO form would be so cool. I want to see Chaos. Like, give us chaos, please. Okay, um... So, to find... We're gonna re... No? Okay. So, to get the parts that I want here, I'm gonna go to uh, lego.com and find... Oh, no, never mind, actually. I probably just do this. Okay. 
Yeah, I think everybody in this chat is big fans of Sonic. UCS Egg Carrier? That would be insane! Uh... We do actually know that later in October, we're going to be getting, like, a giant head for Shadow, like one of those Star Wars... You know, like, those Star Wars helmets? Uh, we're getting... We're getting something like that, but for Shadow's head. That is not what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to import uh, official LEGO, LEGO set. And the set number is going to be 603666. I'm going to re-import that. Okay, cool. And that should give me the part I'm looking for. If it's not here, I'll be a little upset, because then I gotta actually hunt through the entire database till I find it. Right, it's not here. So we're gonna go back to the main parts list. Yes, Chaos and Lego. We already have Chaos Cola in Lego. So there's really nothing stopping them from- oh, I'm kidding. Uh, come on, where? I guess I gotta scroll past the bricks. Uh, did I play Sonic Frontiers? I have not actually played Sonic Frontiers. I don't have a game console of any kind. All I've got is a Mac, which I don't think can run Sonic Frontiers. Most Sonic games I haven't played. Um, so, let's see here. I really don't want a Shadow Bust, but I don't want a mech either. Sometimes I feel, mul uh, sometimes I feel a multi-billion dollar company in Denmark doesn't care about my opinions. <laughs> I mean, it's a, generally it's a smart business strategy to not care about opinions and just do what works for them. Uh, because if they cared about everyone's opinions, then it's more likely for their company to, um, to not succeed. However, at the same time, I do agree that they should at least hear a little bit of feedback. And based and based a small portion of their decisions, based on uh, what is what people are buying and not. I'm just scrolling, scrolling. I'm still talking, but you guys can't actually see me scrolling. So I'll move the camp this the setup over to this side, so you guys can actually see that I'm scrolling down here. Uh, oh, okay. MacBook does run Sonic Frontiers on Steam, and it's expensive. Well, that expensive part is not helpful, because I am broke. <laughs> I buy too much Lego. Uh, do you know about the Portal games? Yes. Uh, oh, yes, finally, there's the part. I have actually played the Portal games before, and I love them. I, I think Portal 2 was the one I spent the most time on, though. I don't play them anymore, but still, they're fun. Reddish Brown? I want to avoid Reddish Brown. Reddish Brown has a bad history. Okay, so now I guess... I guess I kind of just do that. Now, can I line them up so that they work? <laughs> oh, I just realized my dog is kind of sleeping underneath uh, my work area. It's adorable. I'd spin the camera around, except I don't, I'm not using a camera. I don't have a webcam, which is unfortunate. Lego Portal sets, yes? Uh, yes, please. Um, we did get them for Lego Dimensions. 
Like, we got a LEGO Portal set. Uh, and then there's been a few submissions to LEGO Ideas. So, seeing Portal, I find very likely with LEGO. They're, like, LEGO and, uh, what is it? What What's the studio that makes them, that makes the Portal games? Whatever they are, they've got a pretty good connection. Uh, they've worked together in the past. So, LEGO Portal is not yet out of the question. Have I tried to make a LEGO Mario game? I've not. Uh, the simple answer is I prefer Sonic more. However, I do get a lot of requests for Mario, so it is very possible that I will do some Mario in the future. Like, I have also played the classic Mario game. Like, da 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 yeah, that one. Um, so, maybe? I haven't beaten the game yet, because <laughs> that final Bowser is kind of hard. Actually, it's just kind of hard to get to in the first place. Uh, your friends don't like Sonic very much? That is, that's unfortunate. I think a lot of my friends, they they acknowledge that Sonic is cool and just move on with that. They don't, they're not, like, obsessed with the franchise. I said cool and then typed cool into the search. Why am I, oops. Let's move it back there. Um... But yeah, if you gotta convince your friends to get into Sonic a bit more. <laughs> Let's hear. Uh, what else in the chat? You want Gladys? I built Gladys. Uh, in fact, I've built the Portal games with Lego before. They were awful builds, uh, so I will do a redo of that video for the third time. Cause I've I like Lego Portal. Uh, what was I about to look for? Technic, that's right. Oh wait, it is PC. I might be under fire for this, but uh, I like Lego Mario. They're 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 cuts that uh, they're fun and very interactive. My personal gripe is the interactivity and the characters aren't loud at all. Hmm. That's an interesting opinion. I mean, I can kind of see some people liking Lego Mario. It's never going to be one of my favorites. But, uh... My big problem with it is that you need an app to do literally anything with it. Because, uh, it, like, the one thing that would make Mario... Lego Mario is so much better, is actual minifigures. Because that's right now, Lego Sonic does what Nintendo don't. A little catchphrase in the 90s there. Alright, so it looks like I'm going to need some bricks. Of course I'm going to need some bricks. Why wouldn't I need some bricks? Ah! Uh... I thought, for a moment, I thought Supersonic over there was Kermit the Frog. I just wasn't paying attention. Sonic Pancakes! Hi! Welcome to the chat! Uh... Not every kid has an iPad? Yeah. Yeah, I don't have an iPad, which is probably one of the big reasons why I don't have it. I know you can get it on the phone, too, but... Why? What's the point? <laughs> uh... Eclipse Thor says, uh, OMG, I love your vids. Thank you! Uh, put a lot of work into those videos. Oh, we got eight viewers right now. This is good. Getting a bit more. What's the cheapest price? It's lime. The cheapest color here is lime. Uh, Sonic Pancake says, thank you, no problem. So today, for uh, you all probably know this based on the title, but for those of you who are just joining us, uh, 
we are building Sonic Frontiers Giganto with Lego. And uh, I do plan to build this in real life. So, yeah. It's so big that I have to design it in studio before I can actually apply it to uh, real world techniques. Oops. Did you try to make the Sonic curry? No, I have not. I have built like Sonic's race car from Team Sonic Racing though. That was a very, very nice little build. Don't have any pictures of it right now, sadly, and I can't even post them in the stream. Uh, Build a room with Gladys and the house on top, and make it look like you can you can make something with a portal. Okay, tell you what, I do have a video coming up where I build my viewers' ideas. Uh, that's coming very soon. So if you want to possibly see that as an actual thing, then I recommend commenting on my community posts with that suggestion. <laughs> Leave it hollow so you can cram money in it. The ultimate piggy bank. That'd be funny. People, the only people that can steal from you then are people with taste. Okay, so now we've got that done. I think what we're going to do now is connect the front piece of this. So this is going to be a bit tricky. Uh, do you like chili dogs like Sonic, or do you prefer healthier, uh, healthier foods? I'm more of a pizza fan, honestly. Uh, chili dogs are fine, but I actually like normal hot dogs a lot more. In fact, chili dogs are just one of those things that look absolutely gross to make on your own. But then if somebody actually gives it to you, yeah, I'll have it. The, uh, I know that Sonic, like, they're the Sonic Speed Cafe. They've got Sonic's official chili dog recipe. And that looks interesting, to say the least. Um. But yeah. So, chili dogs, they're fine. Nothing... Not a huge fan of them, but I won't say they're bad. Okay, two by two. Hmm. Here we go. What's the cheapest color for this? Dark tan. Ooh. I should get more of these in dark tan then. Uh, glad to see there's a little bit more chatting going on in the chat now. Always happy when my community is interacting with each other. So I think the cheapest color for this is lime. Oh, medium lavender. Okay. Did you? Did I try playing Sonic franchise? Uh, wait. Sonic fanfares? I no. No, I think I've heard the name before, but I don't think I've ever actually seen any footage or anything of that.
No. Oh, wait. Whoops. My mistake. These aren't supposed to go here. Because uh, this is a similar trick that you can do with... Uh, oh, fan games? No. Haven't played any fan games. So here's a cool trick you can do, by the way. Uh, you see, I've spaced these two Technic parts uh, two plates apart. And because I've done that, I can actually uh, grab some Technic pins. Or linkers, they're called linkers. And I can use them to stabilize this area. I first have to get them in there, which is going to create... It's going to have to finesse a bit. There we go. Make that in black. Because I only work in black. <laughs> Batman reference. Uh, Sonic fan games? No, I haven't played any Sonic fan games. Okay, so now, as I was saying, these, these pins are now in place. And if I grab one of these bars, I can line it up right there. No, no issues or anything. And this will help strengthen the build a significant amount. Uh, what do I play for games? I play Minecraft. Um, Minecraft Java Edition, I love that. Um, obviously I like mobile games like Angry Birds. Uh, recently I have been getting into Sonic Dream Team, which I know that's Apple Arcade exclusive, so I only have it for a limited time with my free trial. Uh, but in terms of games, I don't play a huge amount. Generally, I like talking with people and actually being more social than confined doing, uh, just playing games. You made a Shadow the Hedgehog mock? Oh, cool! Shadow the Hedgehog is definitely one of the coolest LEGO characters ever made. There's no doubt about that. You like Minecraft? Yeah, Minecraft's, Minecraft's good. Uh... Oh, you started playing with LEGO more often once you saw my videos? Oh, that is great! It's exactly what I kind of wanted to do with a lot of my pro my videos. Glad to see that uh, I am inspiring others. Let me go up to here. Um, I will say, though, that the plural of LEGO is... it's just LEGO. There is there is no S. How many bricks tall are we going with this? Is that about right? Yeah, that's good. Uh, what was my first Lego set? I think it was an X-Wing Micro Fighter, or it was a, a Lego City Fire Truck from 2010. I'm not really sure. Whatever it was, though, I definitely enjoyed it to the point where I tore it apart. Because <laughs> it's now scrambled in my collection. I do know that when I was 10... No, when I was 8, when I turned 8, uh, I got the Lego Doctor Who set. Man, I love that thing. Sadly, I ended up leaving it out a bit too long and it got thrown in the trash, but, um, yeah, it was fun while it lasted. Like, it was not just a toy, in my opinion, it is art. Yes, you are very correct. Lego is art. So many people use it as art. <laughs> I 
Uh, yeah, I haven't seen any of the Doctor Who episodes in absolutely a very long time, but um, from what I do remember, the show was pretty good. Wait, is is the show still around? I'm not sure. Your first set was a Lego City fire truck. Which one? Like what what year was it? Cause like if that's true then we might have had the same like first Lego set. <laughs> this is gonna be a very strong core. I did like Sonic Prime. Yeah. Yeah, I finished up the show recently. Sonic Prime, that was very good. I'm definitely looking forward to the Knuckles show, though. Like, the Knuckles show looks like it's going to be so much better than Sonic Prime. Really, Paramount's Sonic Cinematic Universe, they're doing a great job, and I've got a lot of faith in their skill. Your first Lego set was a tow truck from Lego City. That's cool. Zero time is... Okay, we've already been live streaming for about an hour, so I'm going to need to... Um, I'm going to need to go grab some lunch soon. It was 2016? Okay. Um, yeah, then I... I don't really remember a lot of those sets that were around in 2016. The main thing I remember from 2016 was, um... All the haunted houses on Halloween, I guess. <laughs> That's it. 2016 wasn't... didn't have a lot to offer. <sighs> your your English isn't good. Your German? Oh, that's no, that's not a big problem. I mean, I can still understand you. You're you're pretty much uh, your English isn't that bad because generally I'm having to translate a lot of people's Discord texts. Uh, which isn't, which aren't in other languages, it's just really confusing to understand. So, I, I can understand kind of mixed up English. Okay, so here, looks like we're going to need a 2x8 plate, specifically. Can that not go there? It can't. Okay, so it's going to be a 2 by 6 <laughs> Uh, thank you. Uh, I, I used to want to work for LEGO, but actually you can make more money by being a LEGO YouTuber. Once you get monetized, that is. Uh, because, like, LEGO employees do not actually get paid very much. Which is kind of surprising to me. Like, I think they only get paid like $32,000 a year. Um. Ooh, your first Lego set was Lego Dimensions? That is, that's a good one. Okay, how am I going to connect this? Because that's, that kind of overlaps the part... I move it up here though, maybe that will be more in line. Huh, that's this is gonna be tricky to connect. Oh boy. How oh, okay, um
Hmm. <laughs> You're kidding, don't make any money? Yeah, same. Still trying to, I'm still trying to make some money. I'm just confused now. Like, that's not perfectly lined up. But it has to be. I mean, I can line it up if it provided I'm working with the correct angle. So maybe if I do this like that, it causes massive problems there. However, it looks like it's slightly more in tune. That can work. I can make that work. However, now I need to do that. Probably gonna need like a one by two. Uh, uh how old am I? I am 16. So, like, I'm, I'm not really that old. Um, I started YouTubing three years ago, and I'm still working towards getting monetized. Why did I search one by one? I meant one by two. I need one by two. Not one by twelve. There we go. So that's going to go in there now. That should fix up that and then that. Brilliant! <laughs> yeah. Uh, I'm not, I'm still really just a kid. Uh, I've, I've not been on this earth for very long. <laughs> I feel like teenagers, though, they're underrated. <laughs> yeah, I'm going through a bit of a voice crack stage, so my I am my voice is changing a bit, but I can I can see why you'd think I'm twenty. Okay, this might be a bit hard to line up. Um, let's grab a two by six brick and hope for the best. The best did not present itself. Oh dear. Well, if I do this and then I do that and then I move this a little bit. Yeah, 16 is teenager. Um, I get confused with that, though, because, like, some people say, yeah, 16 is just a kid, but then other people say, uh, no, your uh, teenager is completely different from kid. So I don't know what to believe anymore when it comes to ages. Come on, come on, piece together, piece together, no. Um... Hmm. What if I go as a play? Uh-oh. Disk space is full and cannot continue recording. Uh-oh. Well, it looks like I gotta wrap the stream here because I'm having a bit of technical issues and I'm hungry. So, thank you to everyone for watching this live stream. Um... We will do a part two, I don't know when, but we will, because I'm not done with Giganto quite yet. 